I feel very weird today. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Got an early class today, so you can't stay for training tonight. Just pop in and say hi. Oh, that's nice. Well, thank you for popping in. I appreciate it very much. Jesus, it's... Man, it always sucked, right? It always sucked for me, right? Uh, Having my birthday so close to, like, to whenever people had to, like, go to school. It sucks. <laughs> You can imagine all the fun that was growing up. Also, happy birthday. Thank you. I appreciate it very much. Thank you very much. Uh, my god. I woke up so late tonight. <laughs> so late. For the stream. I woke up and I was like, ah, oh, shit, it's like an hour after. God damn it. Been very busy today. Very busy. Well, technically yesterday, I guess I've been very busy, but been very busy, right? But hopefully today I get to just rest and have, I don't know, some peace of mind. Alright, just testing out the audio, making sure that it's all work and everything. Birthday is usually during midterm, so you get it. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Happy birthday, here's your test. You sure you don't want to just pass me? No, no, I don't. Alright, anyways. We're back with more Demon Souls, right? Where we last left off, we did a lot. A lot, a lot. Voltaria, completely done. The mines, done. Uh, did a lot in Latria, that's done. Heroes Rest, or whatever the fuck this place is called, that's done. And the only thing left is to head to the Shit Valley. The Valley of Defilement, which is a place I have never been to in this game, which I am not going to have fun with. So, I'm going to get rid of the Regenerator's Ring, and we're going to throw on the Sunken Ring, or Solon Ring, whatever the fuck it's called. Sodden Ring. See? Gotta go. You'll try and catch the next stream. Have a good one. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Don't get your sleep, though. It's very important. Right? <coughs> I'm still getting over a cold. It sucks. Like, I don't... I'm not... I'm nowhere near sick no more, but I still have a cough. I hate it. Got this sticky white slime on me. Oh my god, how much healing did I use before? Yikes. Uh, Thomas, you got, you got some grass on you, right, my guy? Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. We also got to go and save, uh, what's-her-face, Yuria? At some point? Oh, wait, what the fuck did I just do? Alright. Full moon grass. Take that with me. Late moon grass. Take that with me. Wait, what? Can I retrieve item? You would be overburdened. Fuck you. How dare you tell me I'll be overburdened. You'll be overburdened. Get rid of these throwing knives. I don't even want them. Why do I have them? Got these rocks in my pocket. I got all these moonstones. And Thomas won't take my rocks no more. This is the hit list. Adjudicator shield. Uh, Actually, you know what? I'm gonna bring the adjudicator shield with me because it's gonna be slowly regenerating my health so that's gonna be helpful in the valley of shit oh also 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 time for me to look at homeboys what can i carry all right hold up i got too many of these fucking stones like that's just i wanted to keep them because they were upgrade materials but honestly just get rid of them. I'm tired of looking at them. They're making my life miserable. Carrying all these rocks in my pocket like I'm a fucking child. <laughs> Just sitting there like, like, hi mom. Look at all these rocks I got. Aren't they cool? Bloom armor. Um, 
Let's just throw the hit list in here real quick so I can carry it, right? What else am I holding with me? These are lost souls. I don't give a fuck about that. Stun of Ephemeral Eyes. I don't need any of those with me. Uh, I will be needing these, though. Warrior's Lotus. All this shit. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Gloom Armor. Resistance by 28. Yikes. Probably like super heavy, right? Ugh. Fat roll. Fat roll for fat boy. Big old fat boy roll. But if I get rid of this... Ooh, still a fat roll. Yikes, how fucking heavy is this? That's very heavy. Ugh. I'm not getting rid of my cling ring. And I'm still... Oh, I'm still in human form, by the way. Yikes. Bowman grass. Um, stops bleeding. Stops poison. Cataracts plague. Ugh. Trying to think, what the hell am I going to do with all this? Alright. Okay, so without the helmet. But what's more important? Is the helmet more important or the fucking... Let's see. 18. Mm-hmm. 28. Yeah, get rid of the... Yeah, get rid of the helmet. <laughs> Definitely get rid of the helmet. Uh, this doesn't... This protects against poison, but not plague. Brings me to 50. Yikes. I can do without the helmet, right? But the meat cleaver is also super heavy. Same thing with the Hitless, which I'm not carrying with me right now. I should have figured this out beforehand, right? Do 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 do. Imperial versus poison. Okay, yeah. Just want to hold on to the. Oh, why the fuck am I carrying arrows? It's a lot of arrows, damn it. Not gonna use the shield. Uh, where did I put the hitless? There you are, hitless. You have a heart of gold. I do. I do. That I do. I am a golden boy. Alright. Something's got to give with this armor. Uh, do, 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 do. See, this is 28, and the leggings is the same thing. 28. 9. That's the old official stuff. I guess I can just switch out the, uh, the hands. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's the official's gloves. Where's the Imperial shit? Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. I can carry pine resin with me. Imperial spy gloves. Oops, wrong button. Okay, uh, 30. Ooh, black gloves. Old ragged. 
I can't wear the old ragged set though, right? Because I'm not a woman. Yeah, I don't think I can wear that. So, it's either black or Imperials. Alright. I can get away with black gloves. Just barely. <laughs> Alright. Or if I want to rock the meat cleaver. Ooh. Guess we're not going to be rocking the meat cleaver. I don't want to I don't want to say goodbye to my meat cleaver. I like my meat cleaver. Oh man. I need my meat cleaver. It makes me feel safe. It's a big ass sword that you just bonk things with. Hmm. And the gloom armor is good though. <sighs> Damn it. And I'm not getting rid of the cling ring. You gotta be like a psychopath to make me do that. Alright, well, I'll walk around with the hit list then. You know? I'll figure something out with the meat cleaver. As we go. Right? So that's pretty much what we're rocking with right now. Why is my controller vibrating? Might be because I'm in human form. Maybe. Let's stop being human form for a moment. Alright? Let's not do that. Being human sucks. No, let me just look on down and make sure there she is. Don't want to. Like, I'm so scared that every time I do this, I'm just going to land right on top of her. You know? I'll go pick up my souls. We'll do that. Why not? Like, I'm so... Like, right now, I feel so fucking disconnected from the world. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That's how, like... That's how awake I am right now, you know? Like, I just woke up, and I feel like... I feel like I'm not really here. <laughs> Alright, made it in black. See you later, homegirl. Home slice. Uh, actually, let me throw back the shit that I don't. Let me throw it back real quick. <laughs> let me throw the shit that I'm not using. So, none of that. Old official clothes. Say bye bye. Imperial. Bye bye. So we can pick up shit. Uh, still gonna carry the meat cleaver with me. Because if it gets. If it gets too hectic, I can always just throw the adjudicator shield away and just, you know. And just run around with the meat cleaver. Run around with a big stick. Smack things. Alright. Valley of Shitland. The original Blight Town. Never been here before. Take a step forward. How about you fucking bite me? Like, I may be new here, but I'm not a fucking idiot. And that's a torch trap. <laughs> Take a step forward, it'll be fun. Alright. The fuck is that noise? Hello, good sir. You're dead now. Oh, wait, no, you're not. Oh! Where the fuck am I? Oh. Oh, we're gonna have fun here, aren't we? 
Oh, we're going to have a lot of fun here. Okay. All right. Oh, and so it begins, huh? Really? Just a hole right in the just a just a little hello. What the fuck is this thing? Ew. <laughs> See, you are beautiful. Shut the fuck up. I am beautiful, but still. I really hope I'm not going to have to be watching my step all the time like that. It's just a door. Why is that guy bl- why, why- why is this- Why is this here? What happened? What happened to this guy? Oh. That happened to that guy. Okay. Oh, I can't climb back up? I gotta... Okay, cool. And so it begins. See, his problem was like, instead of rolling... Oh, hello, you have fire. Huh. I am so not comfortable in this area. I will tell you that right now. What the fuck? Ow. <coughs> All right. Okay. Oh, what the hell is down there? I'm getting, I mean, like, it's the original Blight Town, right? So. I'm getting that Blight Town feeling where it's like, there's an item. I want to know what it is, but at the same time, it's probably not worth it. So I'm just going to fucking ignore it. Oh my god. The ladder. Climb on down. Yeah, sure, why not? I don't see no problem with this. Besides that guy who's just very happy to see me. That guy hit me from there. I can hit him from here though. With this soul arrow. Alright. He had nothing to live for. Ugh. Kick that shit down. Oh, there's a whole group of you guys down there, huh? Widow's Lotus. Talisman of God. Oh shit. I thought that I thought that was a floor. I thought I had good footing. Ow. Alright, hold up. Let me catch my bearings. Alright. Oh shit. Did not see you. Crescent moon grass. Don't mind if I do. What happened to this guy? That guy got jumped. Why are you standing in the middle of a bridge? Is this bridge gonna fall? It's gonna collapse? I have no idea where the fuck that guy came from. There's a guy behind me, right?
What the fuck? The good, uh... The good, uh, valley hello, right? You look one way and you turn the other and there's like two dudes. Did you think there'd be a hint? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I thought there would be a hint, you know? I thought you'd be nice to me. Is this gonna fall? Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Where do you come from? It's like natural camouflage. There we go. The fact that you guys are surviving by like one hit is constantly annoying. Let me, uh... Noble's Lotus is for poison, yeah? Right? I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy about that. Soldier's Lotus is for bleeding. That's for plague. That's for poison. Uh... I wanted to equip Pine Resin. Eh, uh, yeah... Okay. Yeah, that's for plague and all right. So as long as I don't get poisoned, right, it'll be fine. Pine resin, let's go. You're alive. Wait, are you like an enemy? Okay. What was the point of the fog door? Why was there a fog door? Be aware of enemies ahead. Thank you for the hit. Ain't stone shard. Thank you for that. Ugh, my eyes. Shield up. Watch out for enemies. What in the corner? The fuck is that? That thing's gross. What is that? I don't like gross things. It's trying to hurt me. Oh, I'm poisoned now. That's fun. That guy's dead. <coughs> Alrighty. Do I go this way? Oh. Yikes. I am too afraid to like move around too much because I feel like behind me well I killed the guy so I don't think there's anyone behind me famous last words saint set oh here's a guy here we go I'm going to 
gonna take it nice and slow, nice and easy. Right? Because I've never been here before. Hello. You're a friend. Maybe? You're not gonna start, like, trying to kill me, right? You there. Won't you please buy something? My poor child is hungry. Filthy woman. Black pine resin enchants his right hand weapon with strong flames. You know what? That is very tempting. A mace? Alright. War pick. Albert. Talisman of God. Some rotten arrows. Mail coil. Pain mail. Okay. Stone of Femoral Eyes. Grass jelly. That just looks like a fucking witch's cauldron. <laughs> You know? Black pine. Ooh. That seems very useful, actually. You know what? I got no use for these souls. There you go. You don't deserve to die. So let me give you some advice. Okay. This place buzzes with pests fattened on a diet of souls. All right. You could do worse than keep some lotuses for protection. The price of survival can never be too high. No, it cannot. Maybe. How many years has it been since that witch Astraya came to this valley with that squid headed knight? Those ridiculous white robes of hers. I swear I caught her glaring at my son in disgust. Yes, it's true. She's as nasty as they come. And she's a demon to boot. Not that it surprises me. Okay. All right. Well, thank you, filthy woman. Finished already. Yeah. One is a growing boy. Please be generous. What do you mean, be generous? I I gave you souls, man. Beware of rats ahead. There's rats. The Royal Rat Authority. They're here. Master Splinter in the gang. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh, God. Yeah, there's a lot of these motherfuckers. I have no... What the hell is that thing? There's a big guy over there. And this leads to where? Nothing? Just like a big old hole for me to hop on down and just... Oh, wait. Is that a shortcut? That looks like a shortcut. Might be a shortcut. Oh, what the... F Good thing I didn't just run then. I mean, why would I? This place is very... We're curious, to say the least. Shields up, boys. Shields up. If soul tendency is white, what about that? What if it was white? That's a big boy, and oh, what? Oh! You sons of bitches. Uh-oh, okay. Panic time. Panic time. Yup, alright. Mm-hmm, that's what happened. Okay. <laughs> All right. Valley of Defilement, huh? Valley of shit. This is going to be fun. This is going to be a fun area. All righty. Okay. I think I understand now.
The Hitless is not a fun weapon to use in this area. I will tell you that right now. Um, because I just keep hitting walls and shit. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to two-hand it, actually. Uh-oh. <laughs> Forgot. Gotta go on the other side. You gotta go on the other side. Yeah, this is not gonna be fun. This is not gonna be a fun place. Okay. So you go this side. You hug this side, right? Oh my god. There we go. just kind of want it to fall down, you know? It'd be really nice if you guys wouldn't be able to hit me while I'm on the fucking ladder. That guy just hopped off and died. There's a big old hole that I almost just walked right into. God, I can barely see where the fuck I'm going. That's the fun part about this. This guy... It's hard to tell what's dead and alive. Durability on my hitless is dying so fast. Probably because I'm hitting a shit ton of walls. Difficulty telling. Ooh, don't like how the bridge started shaking. <coughs> I'm having a little bit of difficulty telling uh, distance in this area. Do I just hop on down, right? Yeah, I just hop on down. I guess. I mean, there's a ladder, but still. What's the point, right? I hop on the ladder, they still get free hits. Damn it. I'm not having a good time in this area. That's for sure. God, I can barely aim. What the fuck? What is this angle? Oh, 
Should have brought some sharpening stones with me, honestly. Alright, just make sure there's no guys hiding in there. Come on. That guy, that guy, uh, did what he was doing. I need to go this way, right? Gotta keep distance from you guys, because then I get poisoned. If I don't... And here's this lady. And there's the rats. There we go. Rats are down. Uh, that's a... I'm waiting for the I'm waiting for whoever to drop their rocks that they did earlier. Gonna just walk forward a little bit. guys are out the way. I'm just gonna deal with you. A bit of a distance. Man, you are a fast dude. You're a very fast man. Being in a corner is not good. Still being attacked? Thought I heard another guy. Shield up, damn it. Oh, my God. Hitless, aren't you supposed to be a fast weapon? Why does it take forever for you to do something? Alright. We got these fucking things. You can, you can, uh, you can come to me. <coughs> Alright. That's how I'm gonna play it. Right now. Because those guys have big old spears. And I don't. 
Also, I don't have a stone on me. Yikes. It sounded like someone was coming to attack me, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I didn't even see you. Alright. Let's, uh, let's do this, I guess. You, uh, coming down here, or am I... You're coming down here. Yeah, maybe? Alright, there we go. Those guys hurt. Like, real badly. The fuck is that, a leech? Yeah. What I want to do, I actually want to... Dude, it sounds like... It sounds like someone's trying to attack me. I gotta go slowly, because I really, I'm gonna be honest, I really can't see where the fuck I'm going half the time. You, do you have a sharpening stone? I'm sorry, what the fuck did she say to me? I wasted my breath on you. Did that witch send you to torment me? Shut the hell up, lady. God damn. Please buy more. Okay, I thought she said something different. Do you have a sharpening stone? No, you don't. You you are you are worthless to me. As of right now. I wasted my breath on you. Well, I'm sorry. I guess my, uh... I guess whatever I gave you earlier isn't enough to feed your child. Since you're feeding your child souls. Instead of food. I mean, it is demon souls, so I guess that... If you don't, you don't become soul-starved... There we go. All right. What's this? Umbasa? Oh, Umbasa. Full moon grass. <coughs> Alright, what kind of fucked up boss awaits me here? It's a spaghetti monster. That's freaky looking. Leechmonger. Oh, homeboy's down there. I feel like... I feel like I shouldn't be up here. <laughs> I feel like I should be down there as fast as possible. He's gonna start throwing shit at me? That's the sound of someone who, yup, that's the sound of someone who wants to throw some shit at me. Oh, what are you throwing at me? Throwing, oh, what happened? Oh, uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Health going down. Health go down fast. Health go down fast. Bad. Oh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. No. I see. Yeah. I see. I see. All right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm gonna do this. And then you. We're gonna have, I don't know, some sort of fun. Ow! Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna do this. Boss done. <laughs> don't, don't know, uh... Oh my god, this is a really bright flame, actually. I just wasted grass. That was a... That was a boss. Focus. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Uh-huh. Well, that happened. I'm guessing this is where... Hold up, let me see. I'm not having, like, poison going up or anything, right? Oh, no, this isn't... Hmm. Okay. So I guess there's even deeper water than that? What's over here? This looks like a place where it's like, where you go, ooh, shiny, and then it just bombards you with leech bombs. Sucker stone? That, mm. I mean, I guess it's because it's leeches, but I also guess because you're a sucker, you've cornered yourself. That was a demon? Uh, it was just a, a giant blob of, of leeches. Writhing demon soul. Okay. You are brave. I am brave. I am a brave man. I'm I'm a brave boy. I'm very brave. Brave boy will now uh head back to the Nexus. Swamp of Sorrow. Ooh. That's the that's the Blight Town swamp. That's that Blight Town. Yeah, I'm running back because you. I can forge weapons for you. Weapon for you. Give me something important to do. I can forge weapons for you. Yeah, you can. I can forge weapons. For you. I can forge weapons for you. Yeah, Ed is the one that can level up the hit list. I am going to kill. Myself. Because that's what we do here in the Demon Souls world. Death is an answer. In this video game. Not in reality. <coughs> the Valley of Shit sounds like it's going to be a fun time. So I do not want whatever bit of world tendency I have getting screwed over. How many souls did I have? 9,000? I think I had 9,000. Maybe. Vegeta, what do I have? Uh, not even over 9,000. Okay. I don't know, does anything change? Oh shit, I almost Goomba stomped his ass. Does anything change after going to the Valley of Shit? Oh, I got, hold up. Over here, Thomas. Stop hanging out with Thomas, girl. Don't forget, this guy abandoned his wife and child. Gotta throw those in there. Uh, 
bring these with me. Because the hit list loves to just... Loves to just slowly die in your hands. Now, what is this? Okay, not that good. Still got this helmet with me. You have a heart of gold. Mbasa? I plan to bequeath all my possessions to Saint Urbain. My grandfather's articles may contain more miracle stone shards like the one he gave me. But they'd only be wasted in my hands. Saint Urbain can hear the voice of God through them. Lady, you seem like a waste of talking to. I'm gonna be honest. Like, what do you actually do here? Oh yeah, you. I killed Yurt, by the way. Augustus. I express my deepest gratitude. You have relieved me of a great illness. Oh, thank God. Umbasa. Oh, now you Umbasa. He Umbasa, she Umbasa, and you Umbasa. We all Umbasa. With His Holiness Saint Urbane back, the magicians will have to watch themselves. Thanks to his holy miracles, you brave battlers of demons will no longer be solely dependent on dark magic. On dark magic, you, you terrible Surely Slytherin fucks. Such an opportunity. Umbasa, the darkest of Umbasa. Have you heard the rumors about the Strya of the Valley of the No, I haven't. They claim that she and her loyal knights have become demons. Oh. Lead a clan of degenerate miscreants. Oh. In truth, the rumors are surely unfounded. There are all sorts of wrongdoers down there who would think up such nonsense. Yet, if the rumors are true, then may she be eternally damned for her debasement of the Lord's name. And if the rumors are true, may that bitch go to hell. If the room is up, then may she be eternally... Okay. I love how, like... I love how instantly... I'm assuming Maiden Astraya is probably, like, some sort of priestess, right? So I assume how... How instantly he's like, Oh, one of our folk would do something bad? Oh, no, not in the eyes of God. No, no, never. But just in case... <laughs> May she rot in hell. Oh, is that you again? Do you have further offerings? I don't have shit for you, man. I don't think I do. What do you even teach me? Hidden soul? Dragon demon. I did kill the red dragon. Oh, hold up. Wait a minute. Where am I going? I'm going away from you, dickhead. I want to see what happened to uh to Big Night Man, Big Night Man, Big Big Man Night. I want to see if like if he's fine or not. Is he still fighting the dragon? Oh, I can't. I can't go down, huh? He might still be fighting the dragon. But even, even before that, and you know what? Yeah, we can hold up. It's kind of a waste of time. I'm not gonna lie; it's a bit of a waste of time. Heavy fat roll. Bit of a waste of time. Ooh, still heavy fat roll. Oh, still a big heavy fat man. There we go, that's fine. I want to check on the guy. I want to see if anything's changed. Because I honestly don't know.
really? There we go. There we go. Oh, now you want to hop on down. Half the time you don't even do that. That was a late swing, but it doesn't matter. Actually, let me pick up whatever you're dropping for me. New moon grass, I'll take that. Why not? Like, I should... Like, I'm in pure white tendency, yeah? I should be. Stop trying to shoot me, dickhead. And the dragon's not there no more. Yes, I'm in pure white. So, uh, what's going on with Big Boy over here? No dragons. I'm kind of hoping to see him, like, sitting on the steps or some shit. That shield's not a good choice. Huh. Is he not like... Maybe he went to the Nexus? Oh, what the hell's over there? Don't know if emerald eyes... Hmm. Birthdays are truly the dark soul of celebrations. Hey, Chinese spy. Not a Chinese My bad. I'm sorry. He's not a Chinese spy. Question. Oh. Night shield, night sword. Huh. Oh, thank you for the cheers. And thank you for the birthday wishes. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much. Uh, what happens to Night Boy after we kill F False King Allen? Right? Like, where do you go? You go back to Nexus? Is he hanging out over there? Because I would assume that you see him, like, sitting on the steps going, Oh, man. That was a sure of a fight with a dragon. Ha <laughs> You don't know. You don't play a solo game. Oh, wait. My bad. It's, um... It was Wraith. It was Wraith who had all the knowledge and shit. God damn it. <laughs> Oh, loved. You only got halfway through DS3 before you gave up. <laughs> Was it too hard? Was it too difficult? <laughs> I've only played a little bit of DS3. And I can't wait. I can't wait to get to DS3, but we have to play DS2 before we do that. Which, ugh. Can't wait to play DS1, because I'm just going to punch everything. Don't want to play DS2, but you got to do it. And then DS3, can't wait to do it. Because A, I myself haven't made that far in DS3. And B, DS3 will see the return of Chad Wellington. And I can't wait to have another playthrough with Chad Wellington. Truly the chattiest of Chads. Mm, the Wellington family, yes. MHW spoiled me in DS. And DS3 just felt like a pain to play. MHW. Hold up, give me a moment. I, I got it. I got it. I know, I know what that means. Hold up, I got it. MHW. I got it. Hold up. You can hear the gears in my head turning. Nope, nope, I don't I don't got it. I don't got it. I don't know what that is. What is that? <laughs> Watch be something that I should know. Monster Hunter World. Really? Two different games. 
two vastly, vastly different games, right? I also need to head to where? Where am I going? Lord's Path. Because I need to go pick up Demon Brand. Right? I think that's what it's called. Is that the one I'm picking up? Demon Brand? Soul Brand? Something like that. Damn, big old fat roll for fat man. Oh, well, I don't I don't need to... Hold up, I don't need to be rocking this right now, so I can just throw on the Herculean string, ring, whatever. Big old night boy. Do that for a hot second. Because I need to go pick up Demon Bram. Yeah, but you figure you can dodge and roll the stuff, so basically the same, right? Spoiler alert, it's not. I mean, you can, right? There's those fucking crazy people, again, the people who play nothing but Dark Souls, who are just like, watch me, watch me do... Oh, shit. Did I take off the cling ring? I took off the cling ring, didn't I? I took off the cling ring. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's not uh, let's not do that. That's a that's a dumb move. I'm not take off the cling ring. Yeah, but there's like people who never play anything else, right? So they're like, they're like, watch me fight the nameless king and not get hit once. And I'm like, dude, I'm just never never was that fucking serious, right? Also forgot to recommend. Oh, I don't even know how to say that. I'm gonna butcher that name. Uh, Gachiakuta. That's like the most. That's the most American way to say that possible. You mean Gachiakuta right there? That that uh. Why why did I turn to like Southern fucking Canadian for a moment? Oh, you talking about that anime right there, huh? Mm-hmm. He's a dope ass series. What's it about? Is it slice of life? Is it comedy? What is it? It sounds like comedy. It sounds like comedy. It sounds like some goofy shit. It sounds like some lucky star type shit. If not, it sounds like some getting Tama type shit. I never I'm be honest. Never liked getting Tama. Never cared for it. Never cared for it. Never thought it was I don't think it's bad, but at the same time, I don't think it's good either, right? You know? I'm close to it. It's about a homeboy. We like our homeboys. It's about a homeboy who got expelled from a city... From a what? From a Sky City... Wait, Sky City, what? Like, he got... He got excommunicated? <laughs> From Sky City to a populated Earth, and now, oh, so fallen angel type shit. Now he has to fight his way back up. Has cool anime powers and shit. <laughs> Sounds interesting. I like that. Guy yeeted off the edge of the city. <laughs> was it some? Is it something where it like? Where it takes itself seriously, or was it something where it's like I was hanging out with my friend one day, and they said, "Hey man, yo, look at the edge of that cliff," and I went, "Yeah, sure," and they just kicked my ass off. Now I gotta fight my way back up there. Haha, <laughs> J.K. It's a regular Saturday for me. You know, pull that uh, Forspoken trailer shit. So you're telling me I'm in a magical world, right? And I'm fighting monsters, and I got superpowers? <laughs> like, whoa. Believe this shit. Man, that trailer is like the fucking worst thing possible, right? But at the same time, some people are blown out of proportion. Like, they're that, uh, who's that one fucking YouTuber that just constantly loves just saying the stupidest shit ever? What's his name? Dreamcast guy or some dumb shit like that? 
Like, I was like, I was like, why is everyone so mad at Forspoken? Like, what's the point? And then I clicked on a video. He's like, so, Forspoken has failed to do whatever the fuck. And now no one's going to buy the game. And I'm like, I'm like, oh, because of a stupid trailer? Like, the game still looks great. Like, fuck, what? He made it sound like the main character was, like, fucking eating babies or some shit. It's a battle series. The art is also immaculate. Dream? Quick, somebody play the speedrun music. What? <laughs> what? I'm confused. Alright. I'm scared of this guy. I'm no longer scared of this guy. <laughs> I'm scared of this guy. Just just put a no to him. Okay, so whatchamacallit? Fucking what's his face? Ostrava. He gave us a key to fight his daddy with, but we killed his daddy, so we're supposed to come here anyways. Sorry, buddy. You told me to swing, I swung. This guy hits hard, by the way. I'm actually scared of him. Look how boss he is. He's not even worried about it. Like, my goal here is just to kind of, like, constantly stun him. Like, you're not supposed to kill him, right? I mean, you can, of course. But he's like here to challenge you, give you a trial. See if you're worthy of the sword, right? Hi, Kavito. Welcome back, buddy. I'm doing some pretty good damage on him, though. Uh oh, he starts rolling and shit. At any point, he feels like hitting me. He can just ruin my day, you know. But right now, he's not doing nothing. Oh! Step forth and take the so uh, Hey, let me finish my speech. <laughs> so now we got Demon Bran. Awesome. So Demon Bran is a pretty cool sword, right? Demon Bran and Soul Bran, they're pretty cool. Their damage scales with your world tendency, so I think Demon Brand, the closer to white tendency you are, the more damage it does, and I'm in pure white right now. And for Soul Brand, the closer you are to black tendency, the more damage that does, and you get Soul Brand through using the uh, soul that you get for killing False King Alarant, right? Homeboy that was soul sucking me the other day. World tendency isn't that world tendency fucking sucks. <laughs> also, thank you for the birthday wishes. Yeah, world tendency fucking sucks. I hate it. It's the dumbest shit that they ever did. They should have never done it. And then after this game, they never will do it again, ever. <laughs> Hopefully ever. Right? I'm now gonna put this ring back on. Where is it? All right, cool. But, oh, actually, let me talk to him, see what he has to say. Boss is pretty cool how you actually don't beat him. Yeah, it's pretty cool, I like that. Demon Souls has like the most unique, oh, there's no, okay, he won't talk to me. He's like, all right, you talk the sword. Mm, don't ever talk to me again. Don't ask me for shit. <laughs> But yeah, Demon Souls definitely has the more interesting bosses because instead of being like, you know, instead of being, oh my god, they're hard, right? Most of them are just like puzzles. Which is pretty cool. But then you had to, then you had to Bloodborne in Dark Souls 3 and it's all like, how, how many bosses do you want? I want all the bosses. How much space in the room do you want to fight the boss? I want no space. Like, I think, I think, honestly, I think Dark Souls 3, 
whenever I get to stream in that game, I think that's honestly going to actually be difficult for me. Because most of Dark Souls and Demon Souls and stuff like that, if you're someone who just knows about invincibility frames and stuff, and not even invincibility frames of like, of like your enemies or anything, I mean just for your character, where you're like, if I roll right here, nothing will hurt me. Like, you're pretty much fine. That and like the weapons you use, it, it's basically a game just about animations, honestly. That's all it is, patience and animation. And not just like, jumping down the first hole you see. It's funny how they give you almost infinite space for bosses in Elden Ring. God, I... Whew. Again, still haven't played Elden Ring. I'm not sure when I'll do that, right? Because I want to play Elden Ring, like, really badly, but at the same time, I want to record my first time doing it. And on top of that, it's like, I still haven't really played Sekiro. Like, I would love to do something for Bloodborne. I would love to go through all the Dark Souls games, right? It's just a lot. It's just a lot. I think you'll like it when I get to it. I hope I like it. I hope I hope the enemies won't be too scary. I'm a scaredy boy. Alright. Uh what do I Hmm. My first time with Elden Ring. It's special. This is my Elden Ring. There's many of them, but this one is mine. Uh how the fuck do I get Soul Brand again? Right? Do I just... Hold up. Do I just need the Soul of the King? Don't I need, like, another weapon or something? Iron, lead... Grey Demon Soul, Writhing Soul, Storm, Storm King Demon, Hero Demon Soul, the old hero, Doll, Mixed, Golden, False King. Have I ever played Monster Hunter? I have played, the first one I ever played was Freedom Unite on the PSP, then I played a little bit of 4 on the 3DS. I have Monster Hunter Ultimate try, try Ultimate on the Wii U, right? I bought it just to have it, right? Cuz it's one of the, it's one of the few games that that uh will never get ported over, right? So I have that and I played Monster Hunter World and I got to Iceborne, but I never really did much in Iceborne. Right? But World was great. World was fucking fantastic. I have not played Rise, though, and I'm not sure if I want to play it right now, because at this point, it's been like... Like, Sunbreak just came out for it, right? Well, quote-unquote, just. Like, what, fucking two months ago? A month ago? But, like... Um... But, like, whatchamacallit? I'm losing my train of thought here. But, since they make, like, a new Monster Hunter every, like, what, three years or so... It's like, is it really worth getting it right now? Like, if I get it, I'll get it for PC. But it's like, is it worth getting it right now? Because I feel like within like a year or two or a year and a half, they're just going to be like, here's another Monster Hunter. Right? Rash just doesn't do it for you. It's too fast. Freedom Knight is also your first. Freedom Knight was a lot of people's first. I honestly do want to check out, like, the original Monster Hunter, though, because I heard that one was just, like, so, so vastly different. I want to check that out, and I also want to check out, um, what is it, Dragon's Dogma? What do you need? Be a blacksmith. What do you need? Ugh. Meat Cleaver, Blue Armor. How do I upgrade a weapon? Demon brand. How do I get soul brand? I probably need like some dumb shit. Got dragons dog installed and ready to go. Fucking um wasn't wasn't it on sale for like five bucks 
earlier this month or some shit. For like, because it was like the anniversary, and they're like, we're finally making Dragon's Dogma. Dragon Dogma. <laughs> Dragon Dogma is so weird to me because it's one of those things where I look at it and I'm like, yeah, Dragon's Dogma is that game series made by Bioware, right? And it's like, no, that's Dragon Age. And I'm like, oh, what's the difference? <laughs> you know? <coughs> How old is that game anyways? Uh, Dragon's Dogma, I think it's 10 years old? 20? Is it actually 20? Ugh. No, it's 10. It's 10. It's 10. Can't be 20 years old. That means it would come out in 2002. Because that was like a... Uh, a PS3 like 360 game, right? I'm gonna look up how to get Soul Brand because because I don't know how to get it. <laughs> Soul Brand and Demon Souls. Alrighty, how do you get Soul Brand? Let's see, there's only one chance to obtain the sword at the very end of the game. Each of the oh, oh. You get it at the end of the game. I forgot. You get it at the end of the game, and I think you need the old king's soul to, like, fuse them together, right? And that that gets, like, that makes the northern regalia, right? Let me see. Northern regalia. Uh, is a large sword. It's created by combining soul brand and demon brand using the false king's soul. Yep. All right. That's what I'm thinking of. Because I want the Northern Galia. I never used the Northern Galia before. And I want to see what it does. And I'm not sure if it scales with World Tendency. I think it might just scale with both versions of World Tendency. Thomas, here's these legendary weapons. I, I hope you don't use them whenever you want. All right, I think that's it. <coughs> hey, Wraith, nice to see you again. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Uh, da, da, da. I'm heading back to Valley of the Violent. Wait, do I need to switch? I have my rings, right? Cling ring, solid ring. Okay, cool. Boom. Swamp of the Dead. Seems like a long time ago. Don't remember ever being that popular, but it wasn't popular, right? It wasn't popular because it wasn't popular, but it was like very, what's the word I'm looking for? Ambitious, I guess. Cause like, cause there's like a bunch of fucking weird, like mechanics in it and shit. Like, I don't, I don't know, like, I want to try it out. And it's, it's supposedly, it's supposed to be very Monster Hunter-ish. <laughs> and recently they announced that they're doing a second one. All right. I don't know, it's very weird. It's weird enough to where I want to look at it, right? You know, you know what really, <laughs> you know what's on my mind right now that really sucks? And it's just a personal thing that sucks because for everyone else it's great. Uh, tomorrow, actually, you know what? I should actually get that out the way right now. I should get that out the way right now while I'm sitting here. We're gonna do it live. We're gonna do it live, ladies and gents. Where? What the fuck is this? Phantom Star Online too. That's coming to PlayStation. Where is the game? New games. Where is it? Where are you? Do I want to upgrade a hit list? I mean, yes, I do. But at the same time, I think I think I want to do it without the hand-me-down, right? I mean, it's not that important because I don't think I'm going to bring the hit list all the way to the end game. Where the fuck? Oh, here it is. This right here, right? Comes out tomorrow. I have the game. I have the PS3 version, right? You know, 
a rare game. Now it's not so rare no more and it's worthless. Right? This was worth 200 bucks. Now it's worth zero dollars. I'm a little upset about that. But at the same time, people get to finally play it, right? I love JoJo. I love JoJo so much. I love it. Right? And now I'm going to pre-order it. So give me a second. Let me... I'll be right back because I'm not showing you my card information. you trust us no <laughs> that's my whole government man yeah but like man fucking you know when you have something and you're like i have this and no one else does and i'm happy about it but then you also want other people to see how cool it is that's what i feel like right now it's like god the moment it got announced i just turned I just turned my head, looked at the game, and I said, you're worthless to me now. And it sucks because, because like, years ago, right? Oh, come on. Years ago, I actually had a playthrough of it on YouTube. And then I deleted it because I didn't like the playthrough. But, like, I want, like, at some point I was like, oh man, I'm gonna do, like, a JoJo marathon, and I'm gonna play a bunch of JoJo games, and that's gonna be there, and it's gonna be so cool, but now it's not cool no more, it's not cool no more, it's not, I'm not cool, I don't get to be the cool guy, I don't get to be that cool guy who's all like, man, this guy has a cool thing in his collection, that happens to me with, like, any fucking game ever, though, it's like, I can add any game to my collection tomorrow, and just for the universe to spite me, it will just be like, now it's getting re-released. It happened with, it happens with JoJo, it happened with Kingdom of Amalar, it happened with Nier, it fucking happened with, um, happened with Lollipop Chainsaw. <laughs> right? I was like, oh man, I finally got Lollipop Chainsaw. I can't wait to play this, and then it's like, Love of Chainsaw is getting a remaster, and I'm like, oh, fucking Christ, god damn it. So mad. At least I have the OG game, but why would I want the OG game? The OG game's not that good. Because <laughs> the new one, they're reworked. Okay, so here's the thing about that game, alright? That game is fucking weird. In a sense, like, there was a, like, baby fly in my room. That game is weird in the sense, like, it's a fighting game, but at the same time, none of the controls are, like, normal at all. Like, no one really knows how to play that game. It's unbalanced as shit, and it's fucking weird, and it's, it's, a, it's a JoJo game, right? But now with the new one, they're balancing it out, they're redoing, like, the whole battle system, they're changing the UI, they're adding a bunch of fucking characters, right? And it's just overall a better game. You know? Like, so there's really no reason. There's no reason to go back to the PS3 one at all. Also, when the PS3 one came out, it was when uh, part, part 8 was starting out, right? It came out in like 2010, 2011. So like the game came out in an incomplete state. That's why there was like a shit ton of DLC for it. 
and now like part eight is done and and fucking uh they're getting ready to do part nine jojo world which is like the fucking most terrible name ever for like a part i'm just gonna yeah i'm just gonna run because i don't feel like fighting you guys honestly boom let's see I honestly don't even know if I'm going, like, the right way or not. Also, isn't there supposed to be, like, a meter that shows up to show me how fast I am to getting poisoned? Does the, does the lake itself poison you? Or no? Because I'm thinking, like, it, I'm thinking, like, it's light time, you know? The lake itself does poison you. Okay, so where's the, where's the fucking meter? That shows my resistance. Isn't there supposed to be a meter? Can I buy EDF6 and see if they announce an English version of it sooner? What's EDF6? I think the only time I actually like truly had to wait for a game to get like an English release was Conception, right? The most, like, like, otaku bait waifu bullshit. They released the second one on, like, 3DS and PS Vita back in 2012, and that's when they announced that they were bringing out the first one, but then they went like, oh, fuck it, we're not doing that no more. Right? They went, fuck it, we're not doing that no more, and then, and then they did a, uh, and then they did basically a remake for the PS4, right? And they brought that over a year later. I still gotta finish that game, by the way. I got like a bunch of streams of Conception. I A, gotta upload those, and B, what, what, that was like two years ago I streamed that? Like a lot, I, I still have the streams and I never uploaded them. I should do that. And then I should finish the series. Not the series, the, uh, call it the playthrough <coughs> earth defense force oh yeah no i don't like earth defense force i hate bugs <laughs> why would i uh why would i want to do that to myself i hate spiders and shit it is goofy though is there anything worth getting out there by the way Like, are any of those items worth it? I want to go home. Me too, buddy. Me too. There's a lot of these fucking guys. You know what? From memory? No. Oh, man. These guys have stupid magic resistance. Are there any, like, world tendency items that are worth it? Isn't there, like, an NPC, like, fucking around out here or something like that? That I should be talking to? Or something? There's a red spirit. Okay. So that only makes it quick and easy. It does, I will say that. You guys have stupid, like, reach. And it's annoying. What the fuck? That guy just... Alright. I get... Oh. Oh, hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, everybody. I'm just gonna... We're just gonna do this at this point. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. This was a bad idea. Yikes! Think about this for a hot moment. Oh my god, you have a lot of fucking health for no reason.
Look at that bomb ass roll that I did. All right. Morning star. Nice. Is there like a is it like a world tendency red spirit or is it just like a red spirit's out here somewhere and it's going to ruin my day? Because I really, I really don't want to be finding any fucking, uh, it's out by the items. Okay. It's always there. It's always there, watching, waiting. Is this a boss? No. No, it's not. It's not a boss. I'm a boss. I'm a boss ass bitch. Ow. That hurts. What do you have to say to me? It's no time to read messages. Yes, it is. Shut up. Don't you tell me what to do. I'm not being attacked. Get off my- No! It's my blood! Oh my fucking god! You sons of bitches! You don't do that much damage, you're just being annoying! Almost like real life. I don't even do that much damage, you're just being fucking annoying. How close is that guy to me? Get out of here. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna fight you on this ledge. You're gonna come to me, or you're gonna die over there. Ow. Man, this is like the slowest fucking startup ever. What's the next? Oh god, I lost my voice as I, as I was saying that. Jesus fuck. <coughs> What's the next boss, by the way? <laughs> Shit. I fought a leech monster, right? Quote unquote fought, and by fought, I mean I just smacked it with a stick and it died. Like, what? What else is down here? There's a person behind me. You're like the loudest per Oh god, there's another one. I see you up there. Get down here. Ow. You son of a bitch. Dirty Colossus. Is that one also weak against fire? Can I just like burn his ass? Oh, I'm out of magic. Yeah, another easy boss? Oh, really? Grass jelly. Just looks like shit in the tub. Where the fuck am I going? Pick pick up the I pick up the item. Black pine resin. And what's this? Best of luck to you. Best of luck to who? What? Why would you say that to me? Shields up, boys. Sounds like there's a phantom somewhere. Phantom over there? Umbasa? Umbasa? Is that good Umbasa or bad Umbasa? That seems like it's a trap. Look at that. Look at that trap item. You want it, right? 
Oh, you want this item? Yes, yes, please, I do. Oh, I didn't even see you there. Hello. I can't even, I can't even reach you. Oh my god, I have like no depth perception. Really? What? I'm not even being... He's dead. Bullshit. Alright, well I'm just gonna run past you then because you're just gonna... You're gonna slowly, menacingly fly up to me. For the first time in like three months, you're gonna go to bed early. <laughs> Doesn't feel like a scorching hell for once. Fuck that guy. Go ahead and get your rest, man. The nothing is the best option. What the f- Okay, Yoda. Okay, Telltale Games. Fucking sometimes nothing is the- I thought that was Red Phantom. Sometimes nothing is the best course of action. What the f- Oh, I fell. Oh, I'm stuck. Alright. Let me not- What the fuck is that thing? Oh, it's a slug. It's a slug boy. Hi, slug. You take a lot of hits. Where is... I need, like, a safe spot. What the fuck? I need, like, a safe spot. Out of the swamp. I'm literally just standing on a pile of shit. Everything in here is shit. Something's up there. Ah, fuck. I've been sitting in the, I've been sitting in this chair for a while. Hurt your ass. These gamer chairs are fucking terrible. I only have one because someone gave it to me last year for my birthday. What the fuck? Now I've done it. What the hell you mean? What do you mean by that? Come on. There we go. What the fuck? What are you doing? Oh, it was a poison mage. You son of a bitch. How the fuck you don't? Good thing I didn't aggro all of them. Shit. Where the hell was that guy even hiding? I accidentally figure out how to... How to dupe? Dupe? Dub? What? What? <laughs> had a dub in this game early. It's grossly... Wait, what? I don't... Wait, what? <laughs> I'm confused. What do you mean? Explain yourself. Duplicate. Okay. I think the only time I ever did like any sort of duplication or whatever in any game. Probably like, I don't know. I probably didn't even do it. I think like one time maybe I was playing Minecraft with some fucking friends or some dumb shit like that. And they're like, oh man, look at all these diamonds we can get. And I'm like, yeah, cool. I guess. <laughs> I mean, it's just diamond. <laughs> it's just Minecraft, really. Minecraft's cool. It's cool, but it's something that I will never fucking take seriously. Is this... I'm guessing this is the boss. So I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do this, you know? See what happens. Oh, hi, shit lady. I know you. Would you buy something, please? My poor child is sick. He needs your help. Lady, why are you lying to me? I feel like you're lying to me. I feel like you're lying to me. 
gonna buy all this from you now. I feel like you're lying to me. She's like, my child is so sick. And you're gonna find out her child is like some fucking weird, grotesque being. Did it in DSD quite a bit to get meta level quicker. <laughs> really? <coughs> oh, so what'd you do? Like, just duplicate a bunch of souls? Yeah, a ton of them. Oh, really? Hmm. That's pretty cool. I mean, like, I will say that's, like, the one thing that, honestly, I don't like about Dark Souls, or Dark Souls-like games. It's just that the stupid amount of souls you need to, like, level up in later parts of the game. And I, you know, I get it. Level progression and stuff in your game, right? But, like, I feel like Dark Souls would benefit from not being a game where you leveled up, you know? I, I don't, like having some sort of progression, but also having levels not really be as important as they are, you know, you, you know what I mean? Like most of the fun comes from like finding items and exploring and fucking, and looking at the weird ass NPCs, for me anyways. Whenever it's like, oh, you need a million, bajillion fucking souls to get to your next level, I'm like, I don't really care. All that means to me is at some point I'm going to have to sit down and grind somewhere. Right? It just helps to balance for new players so they don't get bullied. But why don't they just do the same thing that Kingdom Hearts 2 does? Where there's like, there's your level, which... I mean, it means something, right? But then also, there's these, there's a, you know, a bonus level system in which, like, you don't get certain abilities until after you beat a boss or something like that, right? Like, your health doesn't really increase until after you beat a boss, or you don't get this move until after you beat a boss, right? Why is my, oh, because there's a fucking poison mage. I was wondering why the hell my- Oh, there you are, you son of a- Oh, I can't get to you. But you can sure as fuck get to me. How do I get up there? I gotta- I'm gonna get away from him. Cause I can- cause I can feel it on my controller being poisoned. I gotta get to them somehow. This way, maybe? I really don't know. Fun part about that? I saw that guy. I decided to do nothing about it. Let's see. <coughs> Souls are like that, but you can just stay at a lower level. Yeah, but if you stay at, if you stay at a lower a oh, fucking Christ. You stay at a lower level, then, then at that point you're doing a challenge run, right? Like at some point you're gonna have to get your strength or vitality or something up just to survive, like basic shit, right? DS1 and Demon Souls are good examples of that, as you can be very OP early and just smirk. Yeah, that too. Like, I don't know. Or maybe, like, a system where it's like, hey, you level up, but, you know, the enemies scale with you. Or something like that. Like, I feel like your reward for being OP should be, like, maybe during New Game Plus or something. Then after that, like, the limiters just go off and the scaling goes down. And it's just like, there you go. And if people want a hard mode, just click on a fucking, like, here's the challenge mode. But, you know, Dark Souls and shit will never, will never have a difficulty setting. Alright. <laughs> that. Oh, fuck you. Poison mage. 
that age old fucking stupid argument that's like that's like this game should have a difficulty setting it's too hard which I mean I get it right it should have a difficulty setting for people who just find it too hard but at the same time fuck you guys <laughs> it's my game G good We can dance if you want to. We can leave your friends, but oh shit. I'm just enjoying this guy right here. It's my favorite. Let's see. Dark Souls is always supposed to be hard mode. That's what they're notorious for, but it's not. <laughs> it's not hard. I don't feel like it's hard. I've never felt that it's hard. Challenging, yes. Hard, no. Am I? What? What the? F I'm a little confused here. Not confused, but like, don't know where I want to go. <laughs> Do you know? I could go up here. Some people in tents. Did I just walk into the hobo camp? Yeah, I felt like I just walked into a hobo camp. Like this is their homes. This guy's just chilling at home. He's not bothering anybody. And now he's dead. For new players, it's with a little experience. It's not hard anymore. Even when, like, Demon Souls came out. Like, I remember when Demon Souls was out on the PS3 and people were like, this game is so hard. And then I was running around. Like, I was playing it with a friend, right? Like, he was sitting next to me and he's like, yeah, this game's supposed to be really hard. And fucking, I'm running around, like, in Balataria, just, like, you know, just, like, doing the things. The only thing that killed me was, like, the boulders and shit. And I was like, I was like, this game's not hard. And he's like, no, you just wait. And, I, and I'm just, and I just kept playing the game. I'm like, this game's not hard. <laughs> like, I don't know why people saying it's hard. Like, yeah, you're gonna die, but, like, you die in any other game when you don't know what you're doing. So... Is it challenging? Yeah, it's not hard though. I'm guessing this is the boss, right? Wanna test your might? I do. I do wanna test my might. Test your might. Mortal Kombat! Dun, 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 dun. Remember that? Alright. Hmm. Dirty Colossus. How? Mm. This shield is not going to help me in the slightest. Even the regen isn't fast enough. All right, where's the? Where's the? Oh, that's a big boy. Bam! 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 Mortal Kombat! Oh. Oh, you're not. You're not difficult. Okay, that's that overhead. There we go. What are you doing? AoE! Oh. Oh. Homeboy got missiles. Oh, okay. Alright, I see what you're cooking with. Where are they? One, two, three? It was the third one that I just fucking... Oh! On the backswing. I'm gonna heal in front of you because I can. Uh. Alright. Dirty Colossus down. That was easy. Let's see, well, Demon Souls is the easiest thing. You're probably just talented, <laughs> maybe. I mean, to be fair, I did grow up on like fucking. Oh, look how glowy that was. 
I like this arena, by the way. You don't need this much space, though. It's a really cool arena, though. Look at that crevice. That looks so cool. I'm looking at a place made of entirely of shit, by the way, and it's... And I'm saying it's cool. But yeah, I did grow up on, like, Devil May Cry and shit like that, but, like... You know. But put me in front of a fucking Castlevania game, and I'm, I'm fucking... I'm like, this is hard. <laughs> Unless it's Symphony of the Night, you know? 79 is great. I love Symphony of the Night. Oh my god, Symphony of the Night is so good. DOT damage? He had dots? Did he have dots or did I have dots? He had dots, didn't he? I just never got hit by the dots. I love dots. We need more dots. Eroded demon soul. Ooh, that's fancy. I'm rocking 37,000 souls. Almost enough for a level. How much do I need? 42? Yeah, okay. Good at souls life, but suck at MK types? MK? You mean like Mortal Kombat? That's the only MK I know. I don't even like Mortal Kombat, I'll be honest. I mean, I like Mortal Kombat, but I don't like playing Mortal Kombat. I like other fighting games. Like, I'll play Street Fighter before I play Mortal Kombat, that's for sure. Oh my god, Street Fighter 6 looks so fucking boss! I love that shit! Oh my god, I can't wait for that game to come out! Street Fighter 5 suck! <laughs> I don't like Street Fighter 5. Yeah, but MK, I mean like... I don't like MK. I don't like MK, and I want to love, you know, I want to love Injustice, but Injustice is just DC MK. So I don't, I don't like Injustice as much as I should. 2,000 souls. Oh, well, then these won't give me enough, these unknown souls. I was worried sick. Shut the hell up, Thomas. Uh, Renowned Soul, Story Soul. I'll take a Story Soul. That won't be enough, though. It won't, no. Why am I taking a Story Soul? That's stupid. That's a stupid thing to do. I will take a... No, Legendary Soul will be too much. No, Story Soul will be fine. Yeah, Story Soul is like, what, 2,000? No, I need 3,000, though. Mm. How much will I get? 4,000. Yeah, we're good. Touch the demon inside me. Premarital sex. <laughs> She's causing me to sin. I'm out here like fucking Judge Frollo. What's his name? Yeah, Frollo, right? God have mercy on her. God have mercy on me. She will be mine. Or she will burn. What was with fucking Disney and just having a bunch of villains where their main objective was just to get their dick wet? You got Frollo. He just wants to get his dick wet. You got fucking Gaston. He just want to get his dick wet. You got Jafar. He wanted to get his dick wet to a woman who was not even legally of age. Jasmine is not 18, right? She might be 18. Just newly 18. Right? Like, what's with Disney and just being like, hey man, these villains just trying to get trying to get their dick wet. Love watching people play fighting games because you suck at them. I know, right? <laughs> Me too. I used to hate fighting games. I think Skullgirls was what really made me sit down and go, oh, there's combos. <laughs> you don't just press the square button. All right, uh... Kill myself. That's the answer right now. That's what I'm gonna do.
What other Disney villains were fucking just trying to get their dick wet? Now that I think about it. Right? There's those three. I guess you can technically say Cinderella. Because the, sep the stepsisters, their main goal was to fuck the prince. Right? So they were trying to stop Cinderella from getting her, you know, getting her stuff all good down there, you know? Getting her good times. Letting the good times roll. Come on, baby, let the good times go. <laughs> right? I'm trying to think of the other Disney princesses, like, right off the top of my head. I mean, Mulan is like the only one that has a villain that's truly just straight up a villain. I mean, it's just the Huns, right? Mulan is such a fucking great movie. That live action shit is garbage. I don't know why they ruined the live action one. Oh, we wanted to be more historically accurate, so we got rid of Mushu. But here's this witch. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, what? Shut up. <laughs> oh, Mulan, your chi is so great. Like, what? For what? Why? I also love how, like, the Disney live-action remakes just completely got overshadowed by the MCU. To the point where, like, people don't even remember that Disney was doing, like, a whole entire, like, live-action everything. You know? Until, like, the Pinocchio trailer just came out and they're like, oh yeah, they're doing that. Like, I think they did a Lady in the Tramp one recently. And by recently, I meant, I mean, like, probably four years ago or some shit like that. But nobody cares. <laughs> they did Coella, right? I didn't even watch that. Even though I want to, because Emma Stone looks fucking banging in that, in that fucking trailer. I heard it wasn't good, though. Oh, we're just straight up going to the next. Ooh, okay. Next boss. Lady, what are you doing in the shit world? Surrounded by a bunch of dead people? Why is that man just hanging out in the dead bodies? <laughs> the most metal shit ever. I have a feeling the Hitless is not going to do a good job fighting that guy. Go. This is a slashing weapon and that... May you be unharmed. Oh, that man's coming to fuck me up. Oh. Oh no. Yeah, we're going to meet Cleaver this one. I mean, I would, but I can't. I gotta beat the game, lady. Sorry. I'm not trying to plunder. I, they send me to fetch your soul. I'm not gonna do that. You can't make me do that. I won't leave. I will not leave. Homeboy just standing there. Menacingly. Trying to... Trying to test my gangster? Is that, is that what we're doing here? How close... How close can I get without you swinging on me? I want to point something out here that looks really cool. The boss is made in Astraya, right? But I'm fighting her lackey. And she tells me, hey man, get the fuck out of here. You ain't nothing down here for you, right? And instead of this guy coming to wreck my shit, 
he's like, listen, I'm just going to stand here. And if you cross that line, I'm going to swing on you. <laughs> That's really cool, actually. Because they're like, we don't want to fight you. We just want you to fucking leave. Oh, shit. And he's like, as long... Listen. Oh, yeah, no, you're dead, buddy. I'm sorry. Yeah, this fight's over. Yeah, okay. Oh, I forgot I can't roll because I'm a fat boy. Oh, yeah, buddy, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, man. I feel bad about this. Why is she a demon again? What the fuck is that noise? What the fuck are those? Talk to her. Wait. Those motherfuckers went into the water. Hold up. I mean, not the water. The You know what I mean. Hold up. Some freaky ass motherfuckers. Wait, does this... Does this, like, pool thing... Pool of blood, does that poison me? Oh, yes, it... Oh, plague! What? <gasps> that was fast! Uh... What does plague do? That didn't seem like it took my health down that much, honestly. Plague water. Isn't plague supposed to be like stronger poison? Really? I didn't take that. Okay, hold up. It didn't seem like it was stronger. Wait, so. Wait, where the fuck is she? Is she this way? Or is she in the hole? Straight? Oh, she's in the hole? Okay, I'm going in the hole then. Oh, that's her right there. Am I safe in here? No, I'm not. I'm gonna... We're gonna talk to you right here. Yeah? You. Yeah. You killed him, didn't you? I mean, I had to. God, she just gives up. And the fucking... Uh, and the bonfire's right there. So why the fuck are they down here again? Ring of silent prayer. Pure blood demon soul. Pure blood. Uh. Why does the statue look like it's crying? <coughs> oh, when you kill the last boss, it auto starts the next playthrough? Oh, really? Well, I know one thing for sure is that I my like the Nexus ring still works if I go down there, right? Because down there is uh, what you call it, Demon Brand, Soul Brand, one of the, one of the two. I don't fuck it. Soul Brand, I think. Pure. Oh, this is. Ooh, look at that. 
That's fancy. The boss is extremely difficult. I'll be the judge of that. Watch it be like super hard. This is the farthest I've ever made it in the Demon Souls. Uh, do, 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 what am I? I can use the Nexus Binding to return back to the Nexus, right? If I go down there, it's not like a no return thing. It's the real King Allen. Okay. I have no idea. Don't try it. Well, then how the fuck? How the fuck am I supposed to make the Northern Regalia then? If the weapon's down there. Can I level up? This won't activate nothing talking to her, right? If I talk to her, it won't activate anything. Well, it does? Oh shit. So am I locked out of leveling up now? Oh, damn it. So I can't level up, right? That's that's the problem here. Hmm. I can try the Nexus bind. Uh Is there You sure there's nothing in here for world tendency? I'm gonna kill myself, by the way. While I'm sitting here. There is world tendency stuff. Is any of it worth it? Any, like, good weapons or anything? Last boss has no world tendency. <laughs> no idea I didn't go for that stuff. Alright, uh... Well, I'll look it up. I'll look it up and... Oh, shit. <laughs> I almost just hopped down there. Why would they put me right in front of that? I will not relinquish my souls. That's a lot of souls, damn it. That's a level up right there. Boom. 42,000. Let me look it up real quick. Uh, Let's see. Value defile. Uh, I can't even. I can't even say the fucking word. God damn it. Valley of Defilement. Not Valley of the Fire Element. Valley of Defilement, you dumb, stupid fucking fun. World Tendency. Let's see. Pure White Events. Pure White Events for... That's Boletaria. What is this? Stonefang Tunnel. Valley of Defilement. In 5-1, near the bottom of the chasm, on the cliffside path leading to the hut, you'll encounter your first giant depraved one. Uh, climb up the ladder, follow the path, and you'll find three giant depraved ones guarding an item on the ground. Kill these enemies to claim the item for yourself. The rare Estrail Spear. How, how the fuck do you say that? A spear? Okay. Uh, just past the first gate. Uh, Poison the Prey one. You'll see a new NPC sitting on the small island. Selen Villa. Uh, Selen Vendelin. He will ask you, do you know where her brother is? Garl, who I just straight up murdered. Uh, if you have the crest of Vendelin looted from killing Garl at the end of, at the, wow. And at least 10 faith, you can give it in exchange for the Ring of Devout Prayer. 
If you kill her, she will drop the ring as well as the dull gold armor set. Well, I'm gonna kill that bitch. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Assuming you've killed Maiden Astraya, Garl's Black Phantom will spawn in the same area. Okay. He is much stronger He's normal than his for normal form. The same boss strategy applies, killing him. You will get his weapon. Okay. Spawning in 3-5 will let you approach the Garl Vindolin encounter from his front, whereas spawning in... I mean, I said 3-5, my bad. In 5-4, it'll let you sneak up behind him. Okay. So there's a handful of stuff. That's for pure white. My nose itches. <laughs> my nose like really itched like super badly. Oh my god, that was that was terrible. Uh and for pure black for valley valley of shit veil. Uh, there is an ad playing for... What ad is this? Oh, that's for No More Humans. Uh, not No More Humans. What the fuck am I saying? Uh, yeah, no, No More Humans. That's what it's called. The alien one, yeah. That's, uh, for No More Humans 2. That's the only one that I played. On the PS2. Uh, Black World Tendency in 5-2. Just past the first gate. Uh, two depraved ones. Blah, blah, blah. You'll see a Black Phantom. Of, of, uh, Selen or whatever the fuck her name is. You'll battle her on the small island. Uh, defeating her, she will drop the blind weapon and raise your white tendency value. Okay. You fight her. The primeval demon can be found in the same area as far as blah, 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 blah. Is that it? I think that's it. Uh, blind just ignored shields. Really? Um, that's pretty cool. Let me see if there's any, like... While I'm looking it up, let me see if there's any, like, weapons. You know? Like, is it just, like, the fucking... Hmm. See. The spear and girl's hammer. Yeah, those are events. I want to see if there's like any like weapons just laying around, you know? In that big ass swamp. There's got to be something of value in that big ass swamp. There's no way that there's not. Right? Morning Star, the Blessed Mace. Hmm. Just out of curiosity, what are the special weapons that I'm missing? <laughs> Which is like a lot of them, right? The Moonlight Sword? The fuck is the Moonlight Sword? Non-tendency dependent. What? Is that the same fucking sword they put in like every game? <laughs> Big blue magic sword. Oh my fucking god. Oh my, it's the same fucking sword? That's the one from... Bloodborne. Oh my god, it's Master Cheat from the fuck from from Fortnite. Okay, and how the hell do you get that? Valley of Defilement 5 2. The sword is inside a hanging slug nest. Since arrows and magic don't do much at range, you'll want to go close up to knock it down. Past giants and shamans. What the fucking what? I want a big old moon sword. 
with the moon rock. Climb some ramps, hit the slugs. It fought. What the fuck? Let's go smack some slugs. Takes like 24 fit. Really? Oh, then I can't use it. Yeah, my faith is at 16. Yeah, okay, never mind. Damn it. Alright, well, I think, I think I'm pretty good with the meat cleaver. Right? As, like, my, my go-to weapon, that and the hitless. I can forge weapons for you. Worth the grab just to have it. True. Do come back alive. True, it is worth it. I can always swing it around in New Game Plus. Uh, boss is pretty strong, but I should be okay. Okay. I want to check. I really want to check if... <coughs> Let's see. How the hell would I look this up? All right, what question? How mm, how would I question this? I want to see if I can. Well, all right, hold up. I guess Demon Souls in-game leveling. Yeah, in-game. Like I I guess. That's how I would work that. Can always just get in a new game plus. Yeah. I don't want to talk to her and have her like disappear on me or some shit, you know? When I'm rocking 42,000 souls and I can get a clear ass level up. Be wary of your soulmate. The fuck does that mean? Does this game have multiple endings? <laughs> I'm asking too many questions. Yes, it does. All right. Does one, all right, question. Does one just involve talking to her and then the game ends? I think just two is not 100% sure. Like there's no, there's no like skipping the final boss, right? Like if I talk to her, yeah. So I fight, I fight the boss either way, yeah? Because I don't want to talk to her and have her go like, goodbye, game end. It's either walk away or kill her. Again, not 100% sure. Because I don't want to... I want to fight the last boss, right? That's what I want to do. I don't want to, like... Talk to her and then have the game end and be like, There it is, there's the demon soul. Because I'm not doing this shit again. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Hark. I hear a voice of yore. The old one calls for thee. It does. You fight him no matter what? Okay, good. Damn, girl, you freaky. You went to some freaky shit. Into the darkness. Dude, it's already the best cutscene because she held my hand. <laughs> I never felt the flesh of another woman before. The warm touch <laughs> of a woman. 
You're an incel like me, Johnny. <laughs> I love that video so much. Oh, uh, what is that? Look at that PNG that's like obviously moving. It's not a 3D model. Or maybe it's just so big that it looks like a PNG. I'll be honest, I've never seen this shit before, so I don't know what I'm looking at. Kind of like Avatar Last Airbender shit is this. Got those birds for scale. Old one, I have granted thy wish. A new demon. Come now, be good. Goth girlfriend, what are you doing? Stop it. Can't we just have normal sex for once? Took like 30 screenshots the first time you saw this. If I if I touch that, that won't that won't fuck anything up, will it? I wanna touch that. I wanna touch that. Touch it? Alright, cool. It won't fuck anything up, will it? For real? You got no idea. Oh, sh don't then don't tell me to fucking touch it. I don't want it to be like, oh, it seems you're walking away from her. A learning. Fuck that. So what are we doing, girl? Let us proceed below to its lair. You said that in the most casual way possible. She said, let's let's just keep let's keep going. I'm gonna touch it. Return to the Nexus. Oh, okay. I kind of want to walk around and just look a little bit. This is a big ass area for no fucking reason. It's pretty cool. I like it. Got like some Shadow of the Classes vibes to it, you know what I mean? It's like, this is the world in its current state. It's so fucked. Alright, let's go. Homegr Wait, was she following me? Are you following me? She's walking so slowly. <laughs> <laughs> it's adorable. I wish I can just eco it, you know, just take her by her hand and go, come on, let's go. You sure you don't want to level me up one last time for the good times, you know? Let us proceed below to its land. You're so fucking casual about it. All right, let's go, damn it. cinematic you have been chosen by the old one will you seek the everlasting demon souls or has the monumental blinded you whatever your choice you are our first visitor may you be welcome here 
his voice is so distorted, but it still has like an air of still has like a regal feel to it. You know what I mean? Uh question. It's a fog door. I don't see the sword yet. So I'm not sure. Eh, fuck it. Surely you have seen for yourself the pain and suffering that fills this world. Oh, he drops it. I thought you just pick it up. And so created the old one. A poison to the poisoned. The old one will feed upon our souls and put an end to this tragedy. What the fuck? All right, what's the what's the catch? There's no way you're this fucking pathetic. Pretty terrifying. A little bit, yeah. I will say. Oh, get the fuck! What is this? Is this where I choose my ending? Do I go on or do I walk away? I don't. I'm so fucking confused. What? I don't... Okay, I can't go back. Okay, cool. <coughs> uh... Yeah? My work is done? Slayer of demons, go back above. The Nexus shall imprison thee no longer. I shall lull the old one back to slumber. Oh. So if you're tempted by the power, the obviously great power that the old king had that was so awesome, you just straight up kill her now. Yeah, I don't want that power if it's going to turn me into, like, a weird slug. Mm. 
murk her? Why would I do that? That's my girl. Does she turn into like a super badass demon? Cause she used to be a demon, right? She is still a demon, yeah? The old one, along with the maiden, was swept back into the lulling fog. Volataria was spared from the demons, but also lost its knowledge of the soul arts. The souls lost during the pandemonium were never retrieved. And today, the unstable world has another monumental to hold its fabric together. Am I a fucking monumental? Or is she a monumental? New hero of unprecedented power. What the fuck? What? That's really cool, actually. <coughs> Wait, so she becomes a monumental, I'm assuming? Because she's the one that's like putting the demon back to sleep? sounds like i do but i mean like the monumentals they just have to sit there and pray the whole fucking time right like isn't that what they do wasn't the goal of the monumentals were to sit there and pray so that like the demon stays asleep he <laughs> gotta add well if you, if you subscribe you have to see a fucking ad. <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah isn't huh it's both anticlimactic but also very fitting and I like it I like it a lot it's done masterfully I like that I like that ending I really do Jesus. That's a... That is a... Uh, <laughs> that is a feeling that you get. Just wish the last boss was a bit more challenging. What the fuck? Really? Now, are you sure, like, if I, if I, you know, if I went and killed her, it wouldn't activate, like, a new boss or anything? Like, that, that was the last boss? Dude, that is so fucking cool. That's like really fucking cool, actually. Like, I remember the first time I beat Dark Souls and I was like fighting Gwen and I was like, this is cool as fuck. But I like this one way more. Right? Like, I like the story of Dark Souls more. Like the first Dark Souls, right? But for Demon Souls, I like the way it's presented more. This is great. This is amazing. The other souls have incredible last bosses, but this one seems to fit the most. I know, right? Because, ugh, fuck, dude. The whole entire time, it's like, and then the king brought the demons and got, and got so much great power. And it's like, nah, man, that dude was j just became like a sacrificial lamb, but the whole entire time he's all like, can't you see? It's worth it. And it's like, no, it's not. You're a slug. <laughs> You're a little. 
Oh my god, he's so pathetic. I mean, technically, I guess he did get some power because he has like his phantom or whatever, right? The false king. But the dude is just a fucking slug. Oh, man. That's so fucking cool. <laughs> That's so fucking cool. Uh, it reminds me of, um, have you ever heard of the short story? I think it's considered the short story or novella, at least, of what, how, what is it called? I have no mouth, but I must scream. Right? Where it's just nothing but just depressing and dark. And there's no winning for anyone involved. <laughs> <laughs> right? Except for, like, the main antagonist. And it's like... Like, the, Jesus. I get the same feeling, right? That This, like, feeling of just everlasting dread. Dude. The feeling of just, like, here's all these bosses. They will protect me. And then you fuck them all up and you get to the big boss and he's all like, he's all like, ah, I see that you have passed my, my elite guards. I'm just a little sniveling thing on the ground. I actually have no power whatsoever. I, uh. <laughs> like fucking Christ. Dude. Oh man. Oh man. I got like the biggest smile on my face. That. That's amazing. That is amazing. That is masterful. Well done. Well done. Like, there's something to be said, like, when you compare this to, um, like, other games that try to do it and fail super hard. One of the biggest things I can think of is, is, uh, Fable. I think it's Fable 3, because a lot of people have a problem with it, where it's like, I think the final boss... I think the I think the big antagonist or whatever it's like you don't even kill the guy your your fucking partner or whatever your friend in the game or whatever like kills him in the middle of his speech or some dumb shit and it's like the game ended there you go it's finished and it's like what this is great this is great I love this I love this this is amazing this is amazing when you think about it it's like it's like Demon Souls didn't do it did well in the West because of like YouTubers and shit. But when it initially came out, no one gave a shit about it. Right? But this is so great. The bosses are interesting. This is why I wish that like like Dark Souls the bosses had like some sort of descriptors in their fucking, like, when you pick up their souls that you can read something about them, like, I would love to know more about the Adjudicator or the fucking old hero or, like, the Fool's Idol. Stuff like that. <coughs> Story-wise, uh, story is like, one of the best ones. The others were more fun and felt more rewarding. That, that is true. They do feel more rewarding. But there's also some, there's also something to like, you can say a lot with a little. And this right now is saying a lot to me. And I love it. I love it so much. This might be my favorite Souls game. <laughs> this might, might now be my favorite. Souls. I mean, to be fair, I didn't beat Dark Souls 2 or 3, right? 3 was very fun when I was playing it. Bloodborne, I've beaten Bloodborne. That one's really fun too. But like, I don't know. This feels more rewarding to me. I like it. I like it. Hmm. The info is probably on spells and weapons made with their souls. Okay. <sighs> and then this spawned a bunch of games bunch of dark souls and and lords of the fall oh my god wasn't there a new fuck didn't like a new lords of the falling just got announced or some shit 
it's like they're not even calling it Lords of the Fallen 2. They're just, it's like Lords of the Fallen something, some fucking subtitle to it or some bullshit. And it's like, wasn't Lord of the Fallen like a bad game? So why the fuck are they making another one? <laughs> so why are they making another one? I'm really happy. I'm really, I really like this. All right, well. Huh. Usually I sit down and I look at the credits and I and I talk about everything in the game and I talk about like, you know, a little makeshift review, like what I really like and what I really don't like about the game. But I mean, I pretty much said everything that I got to say this whole entire playthrough. And that's, that's awesome. All I can say is that this game is great and I'm, ha you know what, I'm really happy because I would have went back and played it on PS3 anyways. Um, but like... I'm really happy that they're like, yo, the PS5 is out, here's a full-ass remake of this game. So now not only that you get this awesome game, you get it really beautifully done too. And you can see how pathetic, how pathetic uh, that the king is. Jesus. Was it bad your dad made it sound good? <laughs> Wait, what? Was it bad? What does that mean? What does that mean? <laughs> oh man. Lords of the Fallen? Oh dude, I don't... Listen, I played a little bit of Lords of the Fallen and I remember not liking it, but then I heard from other people, like from word of mouth, where they're just like, yeah, Lords of the Fallen is just not good. <laughs> Like, it wants to be Dark Souls, but it wants to be something else, but it can't be something else because it still wants to be Dark Souls. Lords is a very slow game. Yeah. Dark Souls 2 feels like a very slow game, even though it's technically faster. Oh, man. Well, that's it for Demon Souls. The next playthrough we're going to be doing on stream is uh, get ready to... Put on some capes, sit down with some popcorn, right? Enjoy it like it's a movie. Put on your best, like, mean grimace face you got going. We're gonna be playing some Batman Arkham Knight, goddammit. Because, what's it called? Gotham Knights is coming out, and I do wanna play that a bit. But I also wanna get Arkham Knights out the way before, like, the. Suicide Squad game comes out, you know? You gotta watch your stamina a lot more. Slow attack, slow dodges, everything is just super deliberate. Is it like satisfyingly deliberate though? Or is it just like super fucking slow? Because I just assumed that it would pick up later in the game. The DS2 is very much slower, I think. Oh no, it's actually really faster. It's actually a fa- It's because they changed the way, um... I think it's because they changed the... What is it? They, like, changed the engine or the models or something. Something to the animation and stuff like that. Like, it's more fluent, and technically it is faster, but the way it's just animated makes it look slower. And then you fucking... And then, oh my god, the hitboxes are so fucking terrible. Oh, god. And then, for some reason, they decided to... Made it in Black Demon Soul, oh. And then for some reason they decided to fucking like make your uh of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. And then it all starts over again. For some reason they decided to make like your invincibility on your roll like a level up in itself, so when you start the game you automatically gotta put like twenty points into fucking adaptability or some dumb shit, and it's so fucking stupid. You notice those of Fallen felt slow when you played it. Played only a tiny bit from the start, but it did feel super slow. Oh yeah. No, that one's that one's definitely slow. You don't know if it picks up later in the game, but the early game everything moves really slow. Thought it was kinda whack at first. This is the Nexus. Dude, the first fucking enemy they make you fight in that game, that goddamn troll, is fucking terrible. Alrighty. 
then you got this guy right here that's like, you're not going to do it. Well, you slipped through the fissure too. He's like, oh, you're not going to do it, huh? Yeah, you're not going to beat this game. You're going to give up and cry. <laughs> oh, man. Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Dude, this just makes me like... Because we all know, like, um... Alright, fuck. Stop talking to me, dude. Um, you're annoying. You're, you're gonna die anyways. What you doing? Mimi, what am I doing? I'm getting rid of you. Right now. Since you're gonna fucking die anyways. I'm doing you a favor, buddy. Oh, you are strong! <laughs> fuck! You so strong, but you still don't do shit? You gonna keep killing me now? Cause I'll fight you, I'll keep fighting you. Oh yeah, okay. Come on, let's settle this. Settle this like men. Oh, I can't roll, I forgot I can't roll. Damn it. Come on, big boy. Ow. I can't really fight you the way I want to. Yeah, that's a strong ass shield, dude. The fuck? There we go. Oh, I still can't roll? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna end up killing the goddamn maiden. If I don't watch where I'm going. Holy shit, why is your shield so strong? Hey, do me a favor, how about we just go up here, alright? How about we just go up here where we won't fucking, like, straight up merc everybody down there? Oh, he's not following me. I mean, if you don't want to follow me, I'm just saying, right? I'm just saying, I can... How's your magic defense, bitch? Just came here to start some shit. from him. I got this. Fat roll. You didn't expect that, not did you? You have a fucking powerful ass shield, man. There we go. Storied warrior soul. That man is so strong and he's such a fucking coward. Only in Demon Souls, huh? Where'd she go, by the way? I have a feeling that I killed her because I wasn't paying attention and I probably swung and hit her. Didn't I? Where is she? Oh, wait, no. She shows up after I fucking... Yeah, hold up. Oh, you gotta kill Phalanx first for her to show up? God damn it. <laughs> oh, 
Let me get my ass back there then. Where the fuck is the... Here we go. I want it to level up. <coughs> I want it to cash in my levels. But I guess not, huh? That man is so powerful. So powerful, but he's too scared to do anything with it. Alright, well. That's it for Demon Souls. Oh, man. That was fun. That was fun. How much time do I have left in my stream today? I know, I'm pretty much on time. Even though I started late tonight. I think I'll come back later today, though. Because now, uh... Now, since school's back in session for the for the kitties, right? My house isn't filled with children 24-7 now. So, who knows, maybe like a handful of hours, I'll, I might come back and stream a little bit more for my birthday. For my B-Day, for all that other bullshit. But for right now, that's pretty much it. Right? Next stream we're going to be doing, well, next major stream, I like, next playthrough we're going to be doing is, uh, we're going to head to Batman Arkham Knight, do a New Game Plus run of that, you know, fully 100% like always, that means getting all the Riddler shit, you know, hopefully, hopefully the Riddler stuff transfers over to the New Game Plus, because if it doesn't, I'm going to be very upset, but I will go out my way and grab all those trophies again if I have to. Because it wasn't, honestly, it wasn't that bad in, in Arkham, in Arkham Knight, right? Because, like, everything is so fast in that game. That's great, right? <coughs> but, you know, that's gonna be, um, that's gonna be, fuck, it might, it might be tonight. Mm. I'm trying to think, do I want, because today's my birthday, I might call out of work tonight, right? Who's gonna fucking stop me? But I might just go to work for, you know, for shits and giggles. Why not? Hmm. Depends. I'll, uh, you know, on my Twitter, I do what I always do, right? I'll throw out, like, a notification whenever I'm streaming and stuff like that. You know, it will be there. It will be in the schedule and stuff like that. But just in case I don't stream earlier than that, you know, because I'm definitely not going to be playing it later. Because, you know, I'll only stream for a little bit. Not really going to. I really don't plan on doing, like, a playthrough. Playthrough. yet. Um. So, you know, that'll be... On the same night, the same days, like always, all the other bullshit, right? So, for those who came and watched live, thank you very much. I greatly appreciate it, right? For those who are watching this on the YouTubes, if you like what you see, leave a like, comment, all that other bullshit, click the notification bell and stuff like that. Share it with your friends, all that awesome stuff. Help out the YouTube channel. And then, what else? <laughs> My Twitter and stuff like that. You can follow that too. I tweet. I do things like that. And that's there. And that's pretty much everything I want to say. If you uh, if you want to support me directly. Grab yourself a sub. Tier 1. Preferably. Because. Tier 2. I don't got anything for you. And Tier 3. I feel is very expensive for no fucking reason. I don't know why. Tier 3 would be like 30 bucks a month. Or wherever the fuck it is. It's fucking ridiculous if you ask me. You know, how you go from 5 to 10 to 30. That makes no sense. But, um... <laughs> that makes no sense to me, right? You know? And, uh... Hopefully one day when I get a bunch of subs and stuff like that, if I ever get a bunch of subs, you know, I would really love to start giving back and, you know, having, like, a Discord and fucking... and, like, doing giveaways and stuff like that. You know, giveaways that are actually meaningful. Not none of that fucking, like... Subscribe to my YouTube channel and get entered in a giveaway type shit because it's so fucking stupid. It's so stupid. Viewer retention doesn't doesn't stay when people do it like that, you know. <laughs> it doesn't work like it doesn't work that way, right? But yeah, as for the YouTube channel, uh, what's going on right now? Later today, I'm gonna be uploading the spotlight video for Pokemon Stadium on the N64. And uploading another stream for Persona, and maybe if I can get it out, another upload the other stream for um upload another stream for Evil Within. 
and then as for playthroughs or like future videos coming out i i'm probably gonna do something for you know tomorrow when it comes out i'm probably gonna do something for jojo right jojo's bizarre adventures and then um you know probably do like another playthrough or something or some bullshit like that because after the pokemon stadium shit gonna be doing pokemon crystal and probably gonna do like another game alongside of that don't know what it's gonna be might be castlevania might be devil may cry might be some bullshit but who knows so that's pretty much it that's the plan for now uh so right again might stream again later today not sure but if i do notification will be on twitter and that's everything right so as always i want to say thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video as always stay happy stay healthy and take care happy birthday to me damn it